One of the benefits of living in Montana, the ability to see wildlife in so many places. The downside is sometimes those encounters can be a little too personal. Being in, in southwestern Montana, we're all uh, a little bit aware all the time of, uh, of wildlife, uh, whether that's, uh, you know, recreating in bear country, whether that's, uh, you know, uh, going for a hike, uh, you know, there's always a chance of encountering wildlife. And the same goes for when you're on the road, um, you know, whether you're, you're here in the mountains or if you're out in the valley, uh, that, that chance of, uh, of running into wildlife uh, while you're driving is there. This time of year, a chance to encounter wildlife on the road magnified by the weather length of darkness, and the fact that animals are simply trying to survive. We use the highway system to move from place to place. Sometimes when the snow gets deep, wildlife uses it too. West Yellowstone is one uh, where, you know, there's bison on the road. Bison are very hard to see, uh, especially in the dark, as well as, you know, places like Gallatin Gateway where we have elk crossing right there. Uh, but there's, you know, really that, that, that reality exists pretty much anywhere in Montana you could encounter wildlife on on roads. Jacobson stresses the importance of slowing down, paying attention to your surroundings and recognizing the warning signs. They're there for a reason. This week near West Yellowstone, Chet Lehman, MTN News.